We're at Swimman University for the Tom Makerthon event, 72 hours during which teams are going to be working on 11 projects for people living with a disability. The outcome will go on an open source platform and hopefully make a difference to someone uh, around the world. So we're um, Team 7 and we're working with Sif, who's vision impaired, and her guide dog Harlem. I got my dog when I was wearing flat shoes and then winter came along and I had to wear boots and suddenly I was too tall for the harness and when he pulled on my arm I started to fall forwards. So we're working on making the harness adjustable, not just for her but for anyone who wants to wear any other type of, of shoe. It's amazing to be working with engineers and coders and technicians and people from all different walks of life that can really just come together for a, for a single purpose. So I'm Amy and I have cerebral palsy. The problem that I have is that I use crutches which is fine, but it kind of makes your life hard when you're a videographer. So we're essentially building, it's a rig and there's like a stabilising arm that's going to come out, which I'll be able to manipulate. Um, and it just holds the camera nice and steady. One of the really exciting things about Tom is the fact that it brings together both the need knower, the person with the problem, with a group of people who can answer that problem and have the skills as makers to come up with a solution. It typifies what I love about being here at Swinburne, the opportunity to do something different, to partner with our community around us and to really try and make a difference. Okay, so we're on day two, there's about 24 hours to go. Definitely starting to feel a bit nervous um, about being able to complete the challenge, but excited to see what, what the next 24 hours will bring. Today, um, what we're working on is a camera mount for Amy. What we've done is taken some thermoplastic moulds of Amy's shoulder. Now what we're trying to do is bend some aluminium strips to fit with the contours of her body. So right now we've got about an hour and a half left to go and I think my team is kind of scrambling last minute panic. <laughs> um, it's going really well, the harness is done, um, they're just making it look good so it'll be really good to wear my shoes, that will be great. I'm really looking forward to going and filming in the park. Um, I really want to take it like out on a bit of a road trip and go film some pretty flowers and just do some things that I haven't really been able to do because I think it just opens up that mobility a bit more. I mean, it's been awesome hanging out with everyone, but I think they all need a nap and I want to go show this off to my friends. Yeah.